my first day off in 10 days. <laughs> That's a lot for me. I mean, it may not be a lot for everybody, but it's a lot for me. <laughs> I put in a lot of hours, <laughs> but my paycheck is going to be pretty decent. So um, I'm going to do a get ready with me, and then you're going to see this outfit and makeup in a lot of videos coming up because I'm pre-filming today and I'll probably pre-film a couple on Monday also but I am pre-filming a few videos today to get that out of the way because I am just so beat and my feet hurt and everything when I get off work I don't feel like filming so I'm, I do it I'm gonna do it on my days off um, that's you know I'm not one of those that cares that that you see me in the same outfit you know some people do 10 videos a day but they'll change their outfit every time that's not me so anyway let's get busy with this get ready with me you know how long it usually takes me so we are gonna get going I did start already um, I've got my primer on so I'm just gonna go to what I'm gonna do today is um, here wet n wild Fergie BB cream 8-in-1 Beauty Balm Glam Maker SPF 15. This is one fluid ounce. Let's see if I've used this one. Yep. All right, and I am going to use today. I'm going to use the one that I I reviewed the last time. Um, the brush that I got off of Amazon Review Trader, or no, off of um, Review Kick, I believe. Oh, that's so soft. Okay, here we go. Nice so far. My mom and I were going to go out to eat. She just had, this last Wednesday, she had um, a cataract done. They're going to do the ne the next one, I think, I believe it's this coming week. They do one eye at a time. And um, we were going to go out to lunch, and she just decided today she didn't want to. But she went and got some groceries. And... Uh, stopped on her way home and brought me a couple pieces of chicken and some macaroni salad and I told her I'd eaten the last two eggs that I had for lunch and so she <laughs> brought me a dozen eggs too you know she can be pretty dang cool when she wants to be this is super super light coverage it didn't hardly cover anything. So what I think I'm going to do is I think I'm going to do a second second layer of this. This wouldn't I don't even think this would be light to medium for sure. And I don't even feel like it's close to medium. Super, super light. And you guys know I am looking in my mirror because I can't see without it. Brush worked like a dream. Just gonna make sure I got my nose decent. You can tell there isn't hurt. This doesn't even feel like there's anything on this brush. Okay. 
that's done. Let's find the lid. Put the stuff I used over here on my bed. All right, so let's do brows. I just grabbed out of my brow. This is um, Give Me Brow by Benefit. Medium deep. And this is a um, just a little sample size. See, look at the little baby. Little baby thing there. See, this is okay, but... Um, kind of weird using something that's so short. Okay. Actually, that went on very nice. And it doesn't really look too dark either, I don't think. This is the eyebrow that's got the most gray in it. Or blonde. <laughs> okay. And I just left my hair pretty natural today. I didn't, I washed it yesterday, so I didn't wash it today. I only wash it every other day. Okay. Now for eyes, let's see here. Where's my Ulta Eye Primer? Still working on it. Rub my fingers together. Got to be pretty quick because this stuff dries really fast. So if you take too long with this finger, this finger is going to be dry. Okay. So I am going to use some pretty dull, ordinary shadows today. <laughs> and this is um, Classic Nudes by Physicians Formula. And I'm going to use this color here for my base coat. off and I'm going to use um, let's see here choose this color here for my transition Somebody told me to um, make sure I leave my eye open when I'm doing my transition and it works better. And I agree. 
that comet actually saved me a lot because it never looked quite right with my eyes shut. And this here, I can tell exactly where I'm putting it, and I like it a lot better. Okay, I'm going to use this dark color for my lid. And I don't do all the shading and stuff. I'm going to go in with my transition brush or my crease brush and just blend that out a little bit. And of course I'm not done. I am going to go in. The reason I used my dull ones is I'm going to go in with my new palette and put some glitter over my lid. I don't know what color I want to use yet though. Not the most pigmented, but I expected that. I mean, they were very cheap shadows but if they do the job Oh my God, look at that. Can you guys see that? Isn't that gorgeous? Wow. I'll bring you in close once I'm done, completely done with my eyes. Pretty happy with this. So far, so good. Oh, come on here. One, probably about one too many brushes in my brush case. Okay, so my mascara, let's see here. Let's go in with my, I'm going to use the, um, let's see here. It's Styly Style Line and Seal 24 Twist in Sparkling Black. I thought it was going to be gray, actually, but it's black. Okay, I'm just going to go on my lower. is not real good in the waterline. See a lot of sparkles on my cheek. Okay, so there's my eyeliner. Then let's go in with um, Physician's Formula again. One, No, this is Rimmel Wonder Lash, actually. That's what the, that looks like. I forgot. I think I kind of got rid of my Physician's Formula um, mascaras because they were so, so wet and they just smeared terribly. 
And I've heard a lot of people say that they are not crazy about Rimmel la um, mascaras, but I actually don't mind them. I can't say that they're the best. They don't certainly don't compare to my physicians or my my um, perversion by Urban K or any of those, but they they aren't too bad. And some of my mascaras are just about at the end point. I gotta say, in my opinion, I don't think that that uh, CC cream did a darn thing for my skin. I'm gonna bring you in, just show you my eyes now. <laughs> Glitter gorgeous. Oh my gosh. I absolutely love it. It just, it. I like it on top of that shadow. You know, it makes a boring shadow really pop. And you see all the glitter on my cheeks. I can really feel that. Wow, I have a lot of glitter on my cheeks. I can really feel that. Um, that. Uh, CC cream on my skin too. Really feel it. Almost feels sticky. So I think it's probably time to get rid of that one. I probably had it too long. Well, there's no getting rid of the glitter, I don't think. That's okay. I'll just be extra sparkly today. All right, so let's go with the concealer. I'm going to use, I just grabbed one, the Fit Me um, concealer in fair and this is by Maybelline and I might as well use one of my brushes I'll just use this brush Actually, I think that helped a little bit. Honest truth, I don't think that I ever see a whole lot of difference in my under eye lines, but this I think kind of made a difference using this brush. is a little bit tougher to work with. I think it's probably a good thing I'm not going anywhere. It looks a little cakey to me. All right. Now a blush. And I'm going to use my Laura Geller, my baby blush. Uh, Baked blush and brighten in tropic hues. Pretty. I'm gonna clean off my brush first from don't know if I clean it off every day because I'm using about the same brush blushes this week. I'm using three different blushes actually this week, but all right.
Okay. Clean my brush off again for tomorrow. The only thing I hate is not having two days off in a row. Um, yeah. Now, I'll, after today, I'll have Monday off. I'll work Saturday and Sunday and have Monday off. And then I work eight days in a row. And then I'll go to a normal schedule, I hope. Okay, so I'm going to use my new Wet n Wild by Fergie Center Stage Collection um, in Hollywood Boulevard for my highlighter. Also going to wipe my brush off here. I'm going to hurry some mornings, and if I'm using the same one the next day, I don't clean it off as good as I should. I have to wash some brushes today, too. So, all right, let's see how this looks. Oh, wow, it's oh, wow, is it ever gold? Woo, you need a pretty light hand with this stuff. I went a little bit too heavy handed. Clean that off so it doesn't, because I'm using my Mary Luminizer this week for work and I. Okay. Lipstick is all that's left. And I am using my Milani, Milani in Ruby Valentine 08. Okay, there we go. That is my get ready with me for Friday. Well, today is Friday. It won't be up today, but <laughs> it'll be up sometime this coming week. And thank you so much for joining me and chatting with me. And if you like this kind of stuff, give me a thumbs up. I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.